So my name is Clayton Moyo and I teach broadcast media at the National University of Science and Technology in Bulawayo, Zimbabwe. So I met Mark Ferson in 2016 at the University of Cape Town. We were on an African filmmaking fellowship and he told me about the work they do here at the University of Zambia. He's the station manager at Unza Radio and I said, you know what, this is what we want to do at my institution and it would be best uh, or rather it would be better if I can come to your institution and understand what you do and how you do it so that we may uh, try to have more or less the similar uh, model that you use here. First and foremost, we have uh, content for the radio station. Uh, so we have to produce content. Uh, so I do programming uh, together with the students. Um, and then we have to also look at, uh, you know, the marketing side of the station. Uh, making sure that we have promotional materials as well as uh, marketing materials. Uh, but also, <clears throat> we do strategic planning in terms of uh, what are we going to do, say, in a particular year. So we look at basically, uh, you know, the different things that we, we are going to work on in a 12-month period. I'm Gotham Kwanya and I'm the director of programs for Onza Radio. Uh, basically, what, what I do is I'm, I'm in charge of uh, the programming, like everything that, that goes on on, on radio is, yeah, I'm, I'm overall in charge. And one of uh, the most interesting things is that students get to experience the all-round running of the radio station, starting uh, from the programs themselves, reporting right to station management, and that is a great experience for someone who wants to be a broadcaster, for someone who wants to go out there and work for radio stations, and someone who wants to even establish their own radio stations. So this model that they are using here is very interesting, and uh, I think uh, as an institution is something that we may look into and see how we can uh, make sure that the students are put uh, front and center of everything. And the other thing is that uh, it's integrated into the teaching of the students and that is very important in that uh, continuous assessment uh, they get it from how the students perform at the radio station which is great uh, as a teaching tool and I think that's very important particularly for university education so that you have both theory and practical going on at the same time. So students who work or who come to work with the radio station by the time they are graduating uh, they are already supported by commercial radio stations, the national broadcaster, uh, you know, uh, government agencies and all these uh, institutions. And so you won't find any graduate of this uh, university from our department who stays for more than six months without getting a job unless they just don't want because they are given job offers and opportunities before they even graduate. To be honest, I, I've, I've gained a lot from... Uh, this radio station i think when i was in first year i i, I never thought i would I, I would even stand in front of people like a huge crowd and talk to them but right now i, I feel like it's it's something very easy to do. Well, going forward, the University of Zambia and the National University of Science, particularly uh, the media departments, uh, can work together on quite a number of projects. That means coming up with a memorandum of understanding which could be based on, on, on teaching and research, on particularly when it comes to the uh, radio station, content sharing, such things. Uh, they are very possible and uh, we'll be looking into how we work together in, in the future.